How's it going guys? Welcome back to another Mafia Definitive Edition. If you're enjoying the series, like and subscribe, and let's get on to it guys. You fucking phantom. I've been chasing you for three goddamn years. You do life for this, Tom. Maybe you in the chair. You don't want the guy who was punching tickets. You want the guy who was handing them out. So that's what this has been all about, huh? You offering up Salieri. The Don's books. The ones Frank stole. I have them. They're enough to put Salieri away forever, and they're yours. Assuming we have a deal. My family. For the Don. Do you recognize anyone? Look again. <sighs> Old man that's Don Papone, two younger lads of Morello and Salieri. Yeah. Okay, I see it. <laughs> that must be what? 1920? April. Morello's wedding. Salieri was the best man. Jesus. They're just kids. Now they're Eddie's soldiers in Papone's mob. So what happened? How did they go from being best mates to Morello on a slab? I don't know. I didn't even know they were friends. <laughs> but you don't know could fill up the fucking Chrysler building. In 22... Pone drowns up at the lake. Right? In order to keep things running smoothly, Salieri and Morello create a debut up the city. Yeah, I heard the story, so what? Well, their friendship should have made the deal work, but didn't make a lick of difference. After Morello, Salieri was beaming, thinking we ran the whole damn town. Me, I was just happy the war was over. But then I got to thinking about something. What good? It was all of Morello's money if it couldn't protect him from a regular Joe like me. Cabby, for Christ's sake. It only got him one thing. A great big bullseye in his fucking forehead. And that thought... It just kept turning round and round in my head until one day... I'm looking in a mirror. I start seeing a bullseye too. Right here. Dry your tears in the water hundreds, do you? I wasn't about to give up the good life, I know that. I just told myself that I was smarter than Morello. That I wouldn't turn around one day and find Polly or Sam pointing a gun at my head. The thing is, you don't see it. When you're out on the street, scrapping, fighting for your life, then the guy next to you isn't just your partner, he's your brother. You'd stick a knife in someone for your brother, right? But at night, you lie awake, wondering what he and Adam were whispering about behind the bar. Wondering if your best friend is hungry enough to betray you. Any trouble? No bus, no trouble at all. Got something else for me? All these feels a little light. There's a little extra in mind to cover the difference. 
You ever go swimming, Tom? Been to the shore a few times, sure. I knew a couple of guys once. Took some dames out to the lake. Had a few beers, a few laughs. Then one of them decides to go in the water. Gets to the center of the lake and realizes he's running out of steam. Can't make it back in. He starts shouting for help. Now the other guy, he's a strong swimmer. He goes out in the lake to drag his buddy back to shore. Problem is, the first guy, the one too stupid to know when the water's too deep for him, he panics. Grabs his friend by the neck and they both go under and don't come up again. Paulie's your friend. And I know you're loyal to him. And I respect that. But don't you ever pay his tab again. Okay, boss. Good. Now, we gotta talk about this Turnbull. The guy running for governor? The same. He's been flapping his gums a lot about cracking down on our businesses. <laughs> That's rich. He spent more on whores than Paulie and Sam combined. <laughs> you want me to pay him a visit? Maybe put him on a take? No. You can't trust a hypocrite, Tom. We need to end his campaign aspirations, and in a way that keeps anyone from stepping up to the same platform. Vinny, have a plan then? Of course. Turnbull's holding a rally near Central Island. The spot he picked is hard to reach and out in the open. Should have a beautiful view of the rally from the tower of the old prison. From there, you'll give Turnbull the third eye. Okay. I'll go see Vinny about the gun. But don't forget, you only got one shot. You miss, and this crew will usher him out of there quick. I'm the best shooter you got. Otherwise, you'd be talking to someone else. Then get it done. Okay, so... Hey, handsome. <laughs> no. Nah. You're wasted on that wife of yours. You know that? Uh, he'll never look our way. Okay, weirdos. Um, but no. That paper, though, with, um, Senator or whatever, he kind of looked like Joe Biden a little bit. Hey, Tommy. Boss says you got something for me. Yeah, I got a shipment in from a guy at Fort Stanmore. Now, Salieri wants this to run like clockwork, so no heat to the guy's head bursts. I hit little Tony, stash one of these, where you need it. So, up high in the old prison? Yeah. Family's got a lot of history in that place. Hoods who live there now ain't so classy. So watch yourself. Little Tony locked the rifle up tight in a room with a view. Up on the top floor. Sick of that politician shit in the papers, Tommy. We own this town now. Right between the eyes, huh? Find the All way right. inside and make for the guard tower. The top deck is locked. That's what the key's for. Okay, I'm going to take this. And I'll take a uh, submachine gun. I actually... I might take the sniper rifle. No. No, I'll take the SMG. <laughs> I'll take the SMG. Take some bullets and stuff with me. Because that's going to be um, the tr tricky part and stuff. Because if I just take the sniper, it's only got 15 bullets. And say if I need uh, some bullets and stuff. Ooh. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but if I need some bullets and stuff, then say if like, um, they're causing trouble or something up in the prison, then I'll need some extra bullets and stuff to go kaboom boom and stuff on them but if I take the sniper I only got 15 bullets and if there's more than 15 people then I'm kind of screwed I mean I guess I got the revolver and stuff which has got uh which had 18 but I got oh I did not turn well enough or break um but I had the revolver and I had 18 bullets and six in the chamber but I don't know if I think I can 
I don't even know how much it holds. I think like 32 or something. I think it was 30 or something. So we'll go with 30. Um, but... Oh, you... <laughs> even though it was my fault. And I didn't even realize that I had a turn. Um, but no. Um, but if I did take only the sniper and the revolver and didn't get no ammo, then I'd be kind of screwed. That's a weird train, how it looked. Um. Okay. Uh, but no. Yeah, if only took those two guns and didn't get no bullets, I'd be kind of screwed a little bit. I don't know if you can get more bullets for the sniper and stuff. I'd be, could be wrong. I almost about said I'd be wrong. <laughs> Um, all right. Hey, fella. Yeah. Over. What's up? You with Tony? Yeah. Your friend said you wanted the guard tower. Bade me to mark the way with this sign. Folks go through the sewer. Only way in. Then just keep heading up. All right. So we got to look for the... Green circle with slime through it. Okay. Hey, get out of there! Yeah. We ain't going nowhere. Turn cool. Around. Dang. Hopefully that person's all right. Just that cough. That sounds like a bad cough. But I'm not here to take the prison from you. Oh God. Oh, please don't come after me. I don't want to die in the sewer. Do not want to die in the sewer. Someone's coming true. No. Well, you ain't one of us. You're not welcome here. But I want to come through. You're not going to hurt me, are you? I'm warning you, mister. Dude. Yeah, and I'm warning you, but... Oh, I guess it was only 18 bullets then. That was in the revolver. Um... Which way do I go? Okay. I would hate to have to go through a sewer. Because you know it's got to stink. Oh, there's that green circle. Okay. Can I put my gun up? How do I... Okay, I guess I'll just do it that way. Because I know there was like a button where you could push the... Like, holster it and stuff, but I guess you can't. Alright. Keep out. Why can't you people just leave us be? Huh? I ain't here to hurt you. Oh. This is our home. Why can't you people understand that? I'm just here to get a gun. I said, you can keep the you play. Cop? You're locked up tight, not getting in. I'm not a cop though. And tank and I can get in. Someone's coming true. Let's do it like that. Boom. See? Open gate. All right, I'll leave it up on the screen for a little bit. There we go. I don't need health, really. I don't know if I should keep my revolver out or what. Oh, you're sick. I don't want to get near you. Sure, I'll take a little help. You know the guard tower? It's uh, up through the main cell block. He's locked most of the time. Keep the feds out. Thanks. Be careful in here, stranger. We're protective of our own. Yeah, I can see that. I lost my arm in France for this. Sorry. Whoever lost their arm, I feel bad for you for losing your arm. Okay, there is some bullets. I don't think we'll be coming back this way. 
Cause I did see where that. You good? Okay. Um, I think we might be going back out that way with the one drunk dude where he came screaming at us and stuff. It was like, uh, I don't even know. You see my son. He might be... Okay, so I went past like two guys, so... Well, technically three guys. I wonder if he's a kid or if I he's a grown-up. A good job. Don't judge, mister. I wasn't. I was not going to judge you, sir. The money is good as mine. <laughs> is that you? No, I'm not David. I'm Tommy. You good? Cause you're. Oh wait. Oh, that does not sound good. Okay, I do not want to go back out this way. I yeah, can see this is where the um junk guy was. See, that's him. No, that's not him. Never mind. I'm wrong. Oh. Nice. You got pigeons. You're free. I don't know what you did, but you're free now. Go. You watch yourself, sir. Oh. Who? Who you? Dude, I wouldn't try to come up here. With me, pal. Oh god, you actually scared me. One more. Oh. You're good, right? Yeah. So we're good on terms for I uh, sorry for accidentally hitting you. I didn't even realize they were asking for my shoes. I heard, I thought it was like some guy down there. I was like, hand over your shoes. And it's like, what? Okay, I might be in the wrong area. Oh. I guess I wasn't in the wrong area. <laughs> I'm just opening cells, cause I'm, oh. That's already open. Alright, hop through here. Open these. Danger, high voltage, keep away. Well, I guess, uh, then we're apparently gonna get stuck. Oh. Is that something in there? Hmm. Oh. That does not sound good. Someone's drunk. I thought there'd be more of you to evict us. I don't even know what you're talking about. Who's trying to evict you? That's my question. It's like I haven't even tried to evict anybody. Not gonna lie, I thought there was someone standing there. That was actually kind of creepy. Okay, so the elevator... My god. Oh. Because my screen just froze a little bit. I don't know if it was loading. Or if it... Bro, it sounds like it's going to break. Oh my god. Even crackles when it's out here. Oh my god. 
Please do not break. Please do not break. Oh my god, it's gonna break. Okay. We got our sniper. And we're gonna aim for the guy. Dang, he's got a lot of calm. Okay. So... I don't... I, I mean, I... Hmm. Maybe I should have ran. Oh, shit. How long have I been out? Hmm. Don't ask me. I gotta get some help. Or I'm gonna get probably shot by a cop. And then I would have to restart the mission and stuff. I'm guessing this is like solitary confinement and stuff. You know? Maybe I can get in this room to get some. I'll. Oh. I guess it's not that room then, hmm. I do need help. Oh. That. Okay, that's not really. Alright, I will leave it right here. Oh, there we go. The shot came from up here! Chief said he was declared dead at the scene. Okay. So we know there's two guards, and we can't do anything about this guy. Okay, so. What is going on down there? Ah, I'm guessing the cops are trying to get them out of here or something. Alright, grab you. Probably gonna get spotted. Oh, I didn't. Holy crap, that's a miracle. Alright, as soon as he turns around, we'll run down there. Well, not run. Okay, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright. <gasps> no, shoot! Just stay, Tommy. Grab him. Let's go. My character's arm glitched through his body. All right, we need health. That's something we do actually. Can I get through here? Oh, what the heck! All right. I guess we don't need ammo. Cause, um, we're full on ammo, I guess. My lord. I swear, some of these doors Detain are so. everyone you see! What? The police! It's the police! Oh? Ask me. Of course he got the promotion. He's his cousin. This goddamn city. You'll never get us out of here. This place is ours. I just he sound like Lee. Like, 
Uh, is that just me or did he sound like Lee from The Walking Dead? Like Lee and Clement Tom and stuff? That's what he sound like. I mean, maybe he didn't. Should have stayed on track, dude. <laughs> But that is what he sound like though, as Lee from Clementine. How did he not see that? Alright, turn around buddy. Oh, sounds like some more cops. Another few hours kicking my heels. Alright. He sticks a knife in my pocket. Okay, can I free these? I guess not. Alright. Lost Heaven Police Department, City of Lost Heaven. Notice to food. Back at KV. I don't know how you say that. Ev evacuate, maybe? Maybe that's how you say it, evacuate. Oh! Oh my God! I actually scared me. <laughs> Give up! You're surrounded. You can't escape. Up in the city is outside. Turnbull was a good here. man. Hear that? A good man. Sure. If you say he was a good man. All right, let's check there. <gasps> there he is. Move up. Get there. Oh. Move on! Get to his side! Okay. Take cover! Hey, yoink. Yoink. Hey, yoink. Run, Tommy. Don't! Do, 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 do. Help, no needed. He's in a car. Get him before this goes any further. No, I am not. I am a free man. Ha ha ha. You can never catch me. Oh my god. <laughs> Out of the way. Hong Kong. Coming through. Okay. I can't get through. I'll have to go through this way. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh. I'm coming. We got a, a, a driver's side um, flat tire. Yes. Okay, I know this is a weird thing, but I wonder. Because, um. <clears throat> okay, I'm just curious. Okay, now hear me out. I don't know if this is possible or not, but I'm kind of curious. Oh, and I guess you... Oh. Okay. So the question is, can you drive? No, you cannot. Oh, run. Cause I, I was about to say, maybe we could actually get on a boat and just like go. That, which that sucks, you can't get on a boat. And stuff. Cause honest truth, I would have loved to get on a boat and just drive there. 
because that would have been pretty cool, but eh, you know what, uh, you know, like what are you going to do about it, you know? Now I don't have a car or anything, <laughs> so I can't just like go there. My god, your shoes. It sounds like he's in dirt. And he's just like got a bunch of dirt on like the bottom of his shoe or something. And he's just like hitting it. That noise is annoying. Okay. I will skip this part so you don't have to see me basically run. Did you hear about this turnball? Heard he was crooked as the day is long. Says in the paper he's going to be remembered for fighting to pass the 19th Amendment. Put his whole career on the line for it. Which one was that again? Woman suffrage, you idiot. He gave me the right to vote, Tom. Gave it to his wife and six daughters, too. Guess nobody's just one thing, are they? Guess not. I gotta go to work. <sighs> Tom, don't do nothing you don't want to be remembered for, you hear me? Bradley, too late for that. <laughs> Alright guys, well, I'm going to end it here. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Bye guys.